Now I have to ask you about your times in Bowl for My Valentine. Um, obviously, you had the band for, you know, since its conception, basically. Yep. And uh, last time I saw you, we were on tour in the UK, and That's you right. came out to one of the shows, and we had some beers backstage. Cardiff. Cardiff, yes. My home city. Yeah, yeah that's where you're at. Yeah. And you came out, and uh, we were asking you, because we hadn't heard anything yet, and we are like, what, so what's going on with, with Bullet? Like, are you guys, what, we hadn't heard anything. Mm-hmm. And you were like, I don't really know either. <laughs> I, I remember you going like, yeah, like, I don't know what's going on. I, I haven't heard from anybody. Um, obviously, you've heard things now. Yeah. Um, you know, you've moved on to your new band and everything that we'll get into in a second. But I just wanted to ask about um, what did you come to find out? Why, you know, we 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 touched upon Jay and his and his problems, and I, ultimately that was what got him out of the band. Um, and then you were still in the band for a while after that, and then we saw you, and shortly after is when the announcement was yeah. that you were out of the band too. Um, what was what was that story like? What what well, what all? unfolded in that amount of time since last time I saw you? Well, firstly, the best times of my life was in being in Bullet. Met loads of great people. Um, done some cool shit. Um, my wife was pregnant. I was on tour. I went home early mm-hmm. to get help. And we just never really reconnected. That's it? We just never re- reconnected, huh? Mm. <laughs> More or less. Yeah. <laughs> Well, okay. So when you went um, when you went off the road, you were uh, your wife was pregnant and she needed help. It was, it was uh, yeah. She she was in the hospital and stuff, so I was panicking. Yeah. So like, obviously it was uh, it was a home emergency. You went home for and then yeah, and then uh, so obviously I, everything's good there now. Oh yeah, well, everything's good. We've had another two kids since then and stuff. So okay, that's great. It was just a big panic time. Yeah, yeah. You had to get obviously you didn't want to have to cancel the tour, but you know yeah. So uh, was, you know, yeah, let the boys carry on. I didn't want to be the guy going. Yeah, cancel the tours. And what was the um, what was the next conversation like? You said you never reconnected, but I mean there had to have been some kind of conversation with. I was like, yeah, with Matt. Um, I said, I'm ready to come back now. Silence. Oh. Hello, hello. Just never, just never got a response. No. And was it like the next thing you heard was like through <clears> media <throat> or something that they they were moving on or or how did how did I, you I get word? more rehearsals with the guys in between. And um, because we, you know, there was stuff going on in between what was going on, you know. Okay. Personal stuff. Personal stuff. Okay. And um, so we had a jam, and I just said, all I want to do is play heavy metal, man. And Matak said, well, I don't. Oh. And I was like, oh. Okay. Okay, and that was that was the end of the time with uh, with Bolt then. Yeah. Pretty, pretty much. much. Yeah. So I started a heavy metal band. Yeah.